Hey guys, for Collider News, I'm Natasha Martinez. Marvel already has its Captain Marvel, so now it's time to focus on the search for a director. After introducing Brie Larson as the comic book strong woman to the Hall H crowd at San Diego Comic Con, head honcho Kevin Feige said that fans would know who would be helming the film by the end of the summer. Sure enough, word of a shortlist has just arrived. According to The Hollywood Reporter, Nikki Cara, Leslie Lincoln Glotter, and Lorene Scafaria are being considered for the gig. Variety reporter Justin Kroll confirmed the validity of these names, tweeting that the list looks legit, but also adding that we shouldn't expect a speedy announcement from the studio. If these reports prove to be true, that means the Babadook director Jennifer Kent and Kung Fu Panda 2 director Jennifer Yeh Nelson are out. If you were rooting for one of them, fear not. Caro, Gladder, and Scafaria all seem like promising options. Caro is the director behind the Academy Award-nominated family drama Whale Rider. She also directed North County, McFarlane USA, and has The Zookeeper's Wife starring Jessica Chastain scheduled to hit theaters in March 2017. Glotter has a slew of television titles to her name including Ray Donovan, The Newsroom, and True Blood. She's also up for the Outstanding Director in a Drama Series honor at the Emmy Awards for her work on Homeland. While Scafaria isn't as experienced as the competition, she started to build her resume as the writer behind Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist in 2008, and then went on to make her directorial debut with the 2012 release Seeking a Friend for the End of the World. For more on the Captain Marvel director selection process as we get it, head on over to Collider.com, and be sure to subscribe to the Collider Videos YouTube channel to keep up with all the must-know movie news.